what you have inside of this tailgate for the handle function is the two rods that come over and function both of your hinges here. That's what's rattling and flopping all inside the tailgate here causing the rattle sound because it's a tight fit closing. So I'm gonna pull this back apart and what you have here is, let me tell you what it is. It's a four millimeter Allen to get all these out. So you got two, four, six, eight, and your tailgate will drop because your cables are attached to what we're getting ready to take loose here. And I'll show you what I put in here. All right, so you take all those bolts out, you can take this and just flip it up, set it up here, whatever, set it out of the way. So all I did, this is just what's left of an old workout mat of Miss Automatics that I cut to fit down in this channel right here. So all Yamaha did was put these little cheesy foam things right here that allow this to rattle around. So I just decided I was gonna fill this whole channel up and it's just a smooth run. So it'll slide back and forth on this. So when I put the, the piece back on, what I have to do is make sure that that rod is taking this and pushing it down in here. This does make the handle a little bit stiffer. I'm okay with it being stiffer. I'm not okay with it rattling because it gets annoying. So I even left the foam pieces on there still. Probably don't have to, probably can take them off, but it worked just fine that way. So just make sure this stays centered up and the rod pushes it down in there. And now the rod has nothing to rattle against on the plastic of the tailgate. Another thing I noticed I was disappointed with, looked like this got put together with an impact when this initially got assembled and the plastic is cracked on both ends of this tailgate and right here too, which is a little disappointing. If somebody would just put hand put it together probably, that wouldn't have happened. So anyways, put this back together. That's how you solve your rattle with this stuff flopping around in the tailgate here. While you got it off, go ahead and lubricate these with some good lithium like that WD-40 lithium or something like that on there to lubricate that handle up. No more rattle. All right, guys, so it's that easy fixing your tailgate rattle on your R-Max. Just do something within that tailgate to keep those rods from flopping around. You can get rid of that annoying rattle that you hear, especially at idle in those mid-RPM ranges there cruising. So check out the other content on the channel. We've got other videos on the R-Max. Got a lot of Power Stroke Cummins forward content here on automaticgarage.com. Uh, check us out at automaticgarage.com, Facebook and Instagram. We appreciate y'all watching. We'll holler at you later.